On the scene is Leah Mishkin. We have a team of reporters throughout the area, and Leah has been talking to folks in the area who are seeing the aftermath of this all. And Leah, what are you hearing now? So we actually spoke with someone who was here at that subway station this morning. Her name is Karime. Karime, thank you for being with us. Um, so tell me what you saw this morning as you were taking your brother to school. I was taking my brother to school and then I was on the R train coming towards Bay Ridge and then all of a sudden the train came to a sudden stop and uh, they started evacuating everybody. There was no reason as to why. They just said that the trains were going to stop and there was going to be no more trains passing through the 36th Street train station. And then I was I was I was coming up the stairs. I saw I saw and I smell a lot of smoke. And coming up the stairs, I saw maybe a 16-year-old that was shot in the knee. You can clearly see the bullet in his knee. Um, then I stood out the train station on the corner of 36th Street and 4th Ave, and that's when I saw two more victims that were injured. They were in uh, they were wounded on their knee and on their thighs. And how old is your brother? Uh, he's 10. You take him through that subway station yeah. to the school? Yes. Luckily, uh, I had dropped him off already, so I wasn't with him, uh, thankfully. But, uh, I mean, it was a pretty scary moment because there was still a lot of kids. Then everybody is going to work at that time to school. So it must have been scary for others that did have their kids. Um, I wasn't there to witness firsthand, but I did see the, witness, the victims. And it was scary seeing them injured and laying like that. Thank you.